What's going on guys? Welcome back to the next episode of the Broke Beauties. We are continuing our quest in Division 9 right now. And before you watch any of the episodes, we're gonna try and drop likes on the video. Try and hit 100, support the channel, it helps out tremendously. But let's hop into looking for some players. All right, so we're gonna look at the team real quick so you can see what we're guys, what we're going up against right now. All right, in offense right now, that Dylan Larkin's been huge. Steven Stamkos had a big game. Nathan McKinnon, big game. Zuccarello, like this Fiala, the guys are good. Like these, this 80 overall still surprised me every single game. On defense, we might upgrade uh, like a John Carlson a little bit, maybe put like a Victor Hedman in his place or something, maybe like upgrade one of these Charas. But for almost 9,000 coins, I want to know what your guys' next upgrades might be. You know what we're going to do? We might replace, we might replace either Zuccarello or Kevin, no. Let's replace Pedersen. I mean, he hasn't done much, honestly. Pedersen, I mean, the Vancouver guys have been kind of quiet back here. Pedersen hasn't really done much. So what we might do is we might just go to the auction house forward, look for some players who aren't more than 9,000 coins, and just pick one. So here we go. We're going to go forward. Overall rating, we're going to make this like something crazy. 84, because there might be like a, a prime time or something that's going to be good. Might be a little expensive. We want to make sure we're available for that one. 8,800 coins. Tarasenko, says Seth Krupa. Is Tarasenko in 83 this year, though? He might not show up if I do 84s. Ton of players. Who do we want to get rid of, guys? Do we want to get rid of Pedersen or Besser? I think Besser's just a little bit slow. We get Alexander Texier. It's a fast card right there. Super fast. I'm not seeing too much, like, variation, though. Patty Kane could be a fun card. I haven't used Patty Kane this year. How's Patty Kane's stats right now? Matthew, this 85 team of the week, Barzil though. No, I, we hate Barzil, we forgot about that. It says lose Besser. So Besser is a right-handed shot. So let's just switch over that first off. All right, so that gives us 126. So JT Comfort could be a fun card. The dude looks nice, six foot and heavy hitters is the first step. Kane's gross. Might be, might be worth picking up Patty Kane. Oh my goodness, dude, 96 speed. Oh. oh, this guy might be perfect. This guy might be perfect for the team. I want to see if there's any more of these guys. 6,000 coins, and the other one's listed for 35k. I don't know. We might pick up this guy. Oh, we also got Rocco Grimaldi right here. He's zooming. He sure is, dude. I mean, this guy's nice. 5'6". Holy crap, though. I don't know about that, but 5'6 might be a, a hard pass. I mean, I mean, it's 85 shot. It's not bad. It's, it's, it's a maybe. We're gonna look through the other items real quick here. Joel Armia, that could be a fun card. 6'3", 205. Kind of decent on there, this Travis Sajak. Let's check him out though. Eh, it's also kind of decent. No shot whatsoever, 5'10". He's barely rocking a B on his shot. So we're gonna go to the end. Alex Tuck. Oh, I saw that Rickard Raquel, but he's 6'4", 220. He's just not that fast. This Rickard Raquel though, Ricard Raquel. 6-2? That could be a fun card. But, I don't know. Ovi? Do we have Ovi on the team? That's a short check. Just, just going through all the options right now. How much is an Ovechkin? We could pick up Ovi. Ovi might be a good a good guess at this point. Compare his price to see what we can't pick one up for. 9,000. So, I mean, I think this 8,500 card. We could pick up an Ovi. I'd be completely fine with picking up Ovi. I think that's a nice call. And actually, we've always said we're going to use people we haven't done on all these accounts. We have Obi on all of our accounts right now. And I don't think we need this. JT Comfort, Barzal, Grimaldi. I mean, we could try it out. I don't think I'd ever, it's really either between this guy, this Taro Gents. I mean, I really want to try this guy out, to be honest. I got to go with this guy, dude. 6,000 coins for this 96 speed. I mean, decent shot, terrible hands, but I mean, that's the cheapest one. The other one listed is for 90 or for 35K. We're going with this guy. Taro Gents. He's gonna be a huge upgrade and he's gonna be replacing Brock Best. That's gonna leave us with 2,700 coins though. So maybe by the next episode, by the next time that comes around, we play a couple more challenges. Maybe that'll be up around six, 7,000, maybe even 10,000, and then we can buy another big player. But this is gonna be a huge, huge upgrade because Brock Besser, he's just kind of this slow guy around the ice. I'm not really sure like what his purpose is there. Just gotta make sure this guy's righty. He's righty. Indefinitely, let's go, bud. So 85 with that 80 with that 96 speed, we got we definitely got to make him line one. We got to send Stamkos back to line two. I wish there was a, a button to hit that just says like push all players back one, so I didn't have to sit here and go through this process. But I mean the team's still pretty decent, and in Division Nine, 
I mean, do we look for another card at 2,800 cards? I don't think so. All right, let's go from there. If we feel like we have a need for like defense after this next game, we can pick up another player. We're going back into online seasons though, and we are 1-0-0, undefeated up to this point. It's time to just continue on, start playing some games, getting some good internet connections, and feeling the luck. We're actually gonna quickly go over to our power play, just make sure that these two guys, we're gonna take Stamkos off of it and put this other guy on there. Give Stamkos a little bit of a break. All right, that's really all I wanna do. I just wanna make sure my power play's there for it. Server luck, boys, server luck. Ooh, that's a, that's a nasty looking first power play line. Marcus Niemelainen, feeding Steven Stamkos, Pedersen, no, we can't have Pedersen out there. We got have somebody who's actually been playing well. Let's put Zuccarello back there. Um, and then Austin Matthews, that's a sick line one. I like that. No, Austin Matthews, yeah, you're coming up there. All right, here we are, finally. Can you take a picture of that? I'm not even worried about that little bump right there. I'm running with it. I don't even care. I don't even care. Let's go, bud. He's got Dylan Larkin versus Dylan Larkin. Like, this is my alter ego, and he's wearing lightning jerseys? Wait. What? Whoa, 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 What the crap is this? What did this, what did this happen, dude? Oh my gosh, the, the camera's backwards. I was like, this is my alter ego. What? Hold on, we gotta play with this. Oh no. Okay, what the heck? I think our camera got flipped when we were doing Be A Pro. It's prefer up, right? All right, we're ready for this? That was freaking weird, man. I was super confused. All right, here we go. Let's, we're back, we're back. Let's finally win. This guy's like, this guy has absolutely no thumbs whatsoever. The camera got flipped out to weird and be a pro. Oh, over the net. Come on, Matthews, let's go, bud. Big checks in the corner. That's the new guy. This is the new guy right here. Jenshich. Oh, he's getting a penalty called on him. All right, so he's actually, he's he's already producing on the team. Answer something. Oh, Matthews is on the back door waiting for it. I give it right to Zadina, though. Come on, I'm trying to go for big checks. The guy's not bad, though. Once again, if we're playing one of these guys in, you know, these lower divisions who clearly is in higher ones, but they're just, like, replaying with, like, a trash team or something. All right, big save by Vasilevsky. Let's go. Let's put the third line out there. I think we are still stuck out there with our power play line. On Pedersen. We almost took off the team, proved that that was the wrong move. Over the net. Not the best. Let's work it, bud. Work it. He's waiting in his own zone for us. Where is these internet skips coming from? Uh, they're not welcome here, though. I can tell you that much. Bergeron's good. Behind the net. Come on, back door. Be there for it. Pedersen off of a deflection. It's going to bury that one. That was kind of a wild bouncing puck. With a weird internet skip built in there. But Elias Pedersen ties this game up at 1 1. Technically, if camera angles were not completely random this entire time and screwed up for me to be a pro, this would be a 1 0 game right now. Char bomb. Char bomb! Diving block in front by this guy. Who? What psychopath dive blocks Char's shot? Larkin. Embarrass him off of his stick. Off Cujo. Come on, one more, bud. Oh, Larkin, be there for it, please. All right, end of the first period. We After we got the camera angle orientation fixed, we finally got this guy where we want him. Looking at the stats, six to two were your shots. Time on attack in our favor. After the first goal, we had him right where we wanted, just like I said before. All right, we're going to take it to him in the second period, score some more goals. The internet is behaving itself, so I mean, we can't ask for more right now. All right, I just want to like work on some, like, Offensive zone pressure. Oh, squeak in there. Cujo did not have that. That thing was rolling behind him. There's no way he had that one. We're keeping our first line out there. They're working on it. Go on, McKinnis. Be open. One more. Oh, let's kind to go back door. Let's try to bang that one to him for the one T. He's sitting there waiting on it. Nyquist, meet Chara. You stand no chance. Come on, Dylan Largan. Power out. There it is. Oh my gosh, he blocked his own goalie for me. I appreciate it, bud. Thanks for standing right in front of Cujo for me. Stan Costa has something to tell you. It's it's the score and it's two to one now because you got right in your goalie's way. Get out of the way, buddy. You can't block every shot. We're just gonna let him wheel out there and just snipe it. Thanks, thanks a lot, bud. Nice job, Chara. Pass it to Ferraro. Let's go, Ferraro. It's been a while since you had a game. Oh, that's easy. That's easy goal right there. Zuccarello, dude. You know, stinky Norwegian Hobbit or whatever it was. You gotta finish those, bud. It was a 3-0. Nemo Linen sends it up to Fiala. J 
Down to the taste, five seconds left. Oh, just over the blocker and it misses the net, but we're gonna end the second period on the advantage. We're playing some really good people here in Division 10, in Division 9. They're all great people. They're not like people of these divisions before, but I mean, that's what we're gonna do. Steven Stamkos taking charge the tie-breaking goal. We've got Stammer out here. Let's say 11 to three are your shots right now. I mean, the guy's playing solid on defense, so kudos to him, but we got the pressure. We got the shots right now. Vasilevsky's given up. The, really, the only goal we gave up was because we had an awful camera angle. Didn't know what we were doing. How do you keep the poke check out while skating on defense without tripping the guy? Uh, you just gotta like control it really well and just not get too close to him, really. And as soon as you think you're gonna trip him, release the stick and it won't trip him. But I usually trip him like half the time. Oh, break free, dude. Oh, that was a nice poke check or stick lift. These guys are so fast. Boarding, there we go, dude. We're going on to the power play. Waiting for some guys to get free. To the point, down to Matthews. Let's go, bud. Uh oh, yeah, here we go. Oh, dude, you're so close. That was like the perfect setting. Big Jack, boom, dude. We'll see you later after the game. Oh my gosh, what an absolute mash. Oh, okay, he, he matched me on that one. But still, I think that was a lot more fun on my part because if he missed, then that was gonna be a breakaway for him. The game could be tied. No, dude, don't get off the ice there. I was going to pass it to you, and now that's going to be an icing for us. That's awful. It's called being a game changer, and EA gives him decent calls. Yes, absolutely, that's what it is. Buff Daddy. He's flying. He's getting around everybody. Oh, dude, and he trips us because he knows we were about to score with Bufflin, which is something you never come back to. 11 to 5 or 6 shot. He's held a shotless this entire period, so kudos to him. Carry it, bud. Carry him. Help him out the corners, bud. Get up there. Pass it back to the point. Carlson keeping it in. Almost through the screen. Oh, dude, Zuccarello, where were you, buddy? You could have banged it home. One more, one more. No, why would you pass it to me? Oh my gosh, dude, the boys like are going mental right now. There it is, Ferraro, he's getting shut down. Dude, come on. What is this internet? Please, no. Zuccarello behind the goalie, but misses the net. Oh, unreal. Come on, we don't need spikes like this now. And that's how he's gonna get it. <gasps> Vasilevsky, dude, huge, huge, huge saves. Seven minutes left. Gotta stay alive, oh my goodness. Wow, lucked out there again. Come on, send it to the point. Nope, no, no, no. Where's that going? Wide of the net, come on. Up to Taves. We just gotta slow it down. We're going like way too hard. Oh, come on, one more. Oh, McKinnon almost banged it in. Just one last stick we had to get by. Shoves him off, shoves him off the puck, and it's going out of here. Fiala, get down there, bud. Fresh off the bench, dude, Fiala's just running. And here we go, short side, Joseph is there. Shut us down. That could have been like the dagger in the heart of his hopes and dreams right there. All right, McKinnon, one more McKinnon, buddy. Oh, it's just buried in, how'd he lose the puck? That was close, so close right there. Oh, big moves right there, one more. That's, oh my gosh, dude, Taves, the diving stick save by Cujo, but we're going up on the power play. 43 seconds left to go. No, Vasilevsky is coming up huge for us. I thought that was a goal. Ooh, and he's trying to get a fight out of this. He's trying to get a free. He's trying to get a free timeout. Whoa, I don't know, dude. That, those saves were nasty. Come on, bud. Big win here for Larkin. That's gonna seal the game for us. Oh, dude, he shot it out of the rink. What if this is our downfall? Oh my goodness, boys. What if he wins off of this? Come on. Is this Bergeron? Bergeron's gonna win it. I can do it again if I want to because we're gonna win that one two to one. All right, once again, the guy was decent. The guy's super decent. All right, season progress, we're looking at that one. We are 2-0-0. Oh, oh. Once again, 6-0 and oh is the team. Final game stats, 16 to seven. We are there for it. Time on attack, 10 minutes. It was decent. We're gonna look at this guy's team though. It was a huge dub for us, Seth Krip. We appreciate that. Sad it's only two goals, but it's still a win. I mean, Opa, this isn't the puck drop anymore though. This is the, uh, this is just broke beauty. So, I mean, two goals is two goals. We could have won one nothing. I would have been super pumped about it. All right, we've got Anthony Mantha, 84. Trevor Daly, the dude's got all the Red Wings right now and he's playing the all Red Wings team, which is a sick team. Except for that 77. 
This, that 84 I think to see you though. I mean, that's probably a nice car. It's super fast. But guys, that is where we're gonna end this episode of the Broke Beauties. I mean, a win's a win. These guys have been playing fantastic. Like, decent opponents. These guys are super good. Probably, like, you know, in, at least in the top five divisions when they play online seasons. But if you guys could smash that like, we're trying to hit like 100 likes, 150 likes or something like that on this video, guys. Just smash it, and that's all you have to do. But I appreciate the support once again. Come join us on Twitch. We do these things live. But I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. This is Pack Daddy. I'm out.